Okay, we're going to talk about percent of a number. So first of all, let's think about percent. Remember that it means out of 100. So let's say you have a test and it was 100 points and you got a 90%. You could write that as 90 over 100. And the 100 would be the whole amount, the entire amount that you could have earned on the test, the total number of points. And the 90 is the part or the portion that you got correct. So we can represent this as a part to a whole. So let's just think about that for a moment here. We're going to use proportions now to solve a percent of a number. So let's get this out of the way. Okay, 28% of 65. So if we're going to set up a proportion, we know we'll have two ratios set equal to each other. One of the ratios is easy to figure out. It's going to be 28%, which we write as 28 over 100. 28 out of 100. And remember, as we just saw, the whole amount is the 100 in this case, and the part is the 28. So if we have in a proportion part to whole, then we'll need to go part to whole up here. So we're going to need to put a part here and a whole down here. If it says 28% of 65, we're looking for an amount out of the 65. 65 then must be my whole amount. In fact, usually when you see of, yes, it means multiplication, but also it can mean that it's the whole amount that you're talking about. So 28% of 65, of this 65 that I have here, what is the portion that is 28%? And that's where I'll put my x. And so now I just have a simple proportion that I'm going to solve. And I just cross multiply. So we'll do 65 times 28 equals 100x. So that equals 1,820 equals 100x. We'll divide both sides by 100. And that means the decimal point just comes back two places. And we have x equals. 18 and 2 tenths, 18.2. So therefore, 28% of 65 is 18 and 2 tenths. Thank you.